Yeah. Nowadays, Reaganomics coming back just to fast the boxes. While it's anorexic, it got a fat in my pockets. Find a way to double my profits. Cause stepping on my product isn't part of the process. Homegirl says she gonna be rocking it topless. I said, roll slow, your roll, but just don't let me catch you on the stroll behind my gummer projects. But the options are little to none. It's all enough to make you pick up a gun and live life on the run as an outlaw. Things ain't working right, switch to the south pole. Reading through the secret, so I'm reaching for my zenith, then I'm putting it out more. It's a slow crawl to financial elevation when you're wasting all your time at a modern plantation. $40,000 on a college education seem wasted when you living in the motherfucking basement. Fixing down Jones, retirement's gone. Bank won't loan and the home vault closed. Those in glass houses better not throw stone, cause it's looking like time to get your credit card clone, huh? We're gonna do it like this. Yo. Time ain't never gonna stop for you, so why proceed how I got to do? My impulse told me to clean up my desk and then get my job to boot. Gave up trying to get fired. Cared too much about my enjoyment. Gotta find a way not to compensate for going paid unemployment. I'm gonna get a fake ID and say I work for AIG. Then dip my hand in that bailout stash and snatch all the cake I need. Two bags of cream, my gasoline, my wallet, gotta get that fuel. Need notoriety for sole propriety and not as a rich man's mule. Cause if the year 2012 really does mean I were blown up, it's and I'ma roam this earth and mark my turf till me and the angels coexist. So basically, for all y'all fucking people out there that didn't know, this is my brother Rugged and Raw right here. What up, what up? And I didn't have to pay him to wear this shirt. Not at all. You know what I'm saying? But nah, we working on an album right now. It's uh, called Muhammad Dangerfield. And it's basically, you know, we just been doing work. Like, what's the first song we did together was a while back from my man um, Smarty Pants' album. Like, man, that might have been like five, six years ago or something like that. It's like, oh, three. That was before we even met each other. We just wound up on a song together and we was both like, yo, that dude nice. And then we just started building with each other more through, through impact and all that. And now we here actually sitting down and, and building and recording this album. And it's gonna be like, it, it's different than than what we've both done as individuals, but it still has the core elements of what has, what people have heard from us already. So it's kind of like just working together on it, you know? Where pretty much it's everything you're gonna expect and not gonna expect all at the same time. You know, it like, it just totally makes sense. The title will speak for itself. And that's what it's got to be. Yeah, basically. So, like, if you didn't know, you know what I'm saying, you can sit there, ponder, and question all the good stuff about Muhammad Dangerfield, but you won't know until you really hear, you know, like, really hear it. You sit down and listen to it. You know, we got production from Craig Rip, Static, you know. Ace of Buchanan. Ace of Buchanan, my man Iron Braids, and, you know, a couple more. Captain you know, Planet couple of guest features and stuff like that that y'all got to be prepared for so you know we all keep coming ahead keep building and all of that and right here you know we got the super engineer mike marvel he trying to act like you know act like he's clean and shit why you act, why you trying, <laughs> trying to act like he clean and stuff he ain't clean his studio in like 14 years it's the same <laughs> nah just fucking around nah this 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 the spot right here you know what I'm saying you might have seen it in a couple other um interviews and stuff like that. This is where, you know, called it Paradise Lost, Children of God, Tales of the Lost Tribe and all of that. And yo, this is just the spot right here. So if you in Jersey City and you need something recorded, you need to holla at Mike Marvel. You know what I'm saying? And don't forget that you're watching simplyflow.com. This is the Life in Black and White blog. I'm here with my brother Rugged and Raw, Mo Danger Field. Recording session two is the second one. The first one we knocked out four songs. So Look for that album real soon. Selling it out the trunk of my car. Selling out of my uh, out of my duffel bag that got the little hole in it and everything. You know what I'm saying? At your local chicken shack, you could get it with a blunt wrap. You know what I'm saying? Take it home real cheap. You know what I'm saying? So stay on the lookout. Peace.